Hello everyone, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Michelle and today I'm here to carve a pumpkin for you all. So uh, in the past, I've done Sam and Colby, TFIL, uh, Selena Spooky Boo, and Call Me Chris. I did a Hocus Pocus one as well. And this year, I'm going to be doing, drum roll please, I'm going to be doing Project Fear. So um, if you guys know who that is, that's okay. I will let you know. So Project Fear is, um, they were originally a TV show where they did investigations, kind of like Ghost Adventures. I do believe that Dom, uh, Dominic, da Dominic? No, Dakota, sorry. I do believe that Dakota was tied to Ghost Adventures at one point or that he has had an experience with Zach Baggins. However, um, they basically do like Sam and Colby or Exploring with Josh. It's their own thing. They go in, they do investigations of different haunted places, and then they put up videos on YouTube. Originally, they did have a TV show called Destination Fear. However, it was unfortunately canceled before I even ever got to see it. <laughs> so um, I actually recently found them. I think I found them about... Honestly, I think I started getting notifications as soon as they started uploading videos. And then by the time they finally uh, did a video with Sam and Colby, I had actually seen every video they'd uploaded. So this is the first time I'm doing somebody that I haven't found because of Sam and Colby. So that's cool. Um, so the four members of Project Fear are, we've got Alex and Chelsea, and then we have Tanner, and Dakota. Now, again, I'm doing these these stencils in a way that I can read them. I'm not very worried about if you guys can read them. Um, I do have tutorials up on my channel of how to make stencils if you are curious. Um, the basics of it are I find a really well lit photo. The, these photos were made up of two different um, thumbnails that were on Google. So it was, um, yeah, two thumbnails for videos of theirs. Uh, these two were together in theirs and these two were together in theirs. And then what I did was I just cut the background out on Canva. Then I went over to Jimp and I put it into Threshold, which turns it into this black and white type thing you see here. Now in the past, I've only actually done like live women once and that was Chris and Selena. And I, for some reason, I'm so much more nervous about about carving, I almost said doing women again, but carving women than I am with carving men just because, I don't know, it just, it just <sighs> makes me more nervous. And there is a girl in this group. So how I've got it or how I'm planning to do it is I'm going to have um, Tanner and Alex on the outside and then Chelsea is going to be next to Dakota on the inside. I had to put it on two separate pieces of paper, but I'm going to cut them out the way I need them. And then right up above their heads, I've actually traced out their logo. And so I'm going to have that kind of in between them. You guys will just have to see, that's kind of how it's working in my head. Um, I'm really, really nervous about this one. I don't know why, it's been a little while. I know it's been a really long time since I've uploaded, except for it hasn't been because I did do a video with my son last week. Um, however, otherwise, it's been a very long time since I've uploaded. Not really gonna go into anything. All I'm gonna say is, it's been a really hard time to get motivated on this channel because I feel like all that I'm like doing is trying to find what you guys want. And that's awesome. I want to do what you guys want, but at the same time, I haven't been doing anything that I wanted. So I've recently found a new passion in like budgeting and I've actually got a, a channel now dedicated to budgeting and I'm actually loving that experience. I've got an Etsy shop and all that stuff now too and that's a whole new venture for me but um, I do wanna come back to this channel at some point. I just really need to work at finding the motivation to do that because at the end of the day, like my motivation was always like, I wanted to do ghost hunts. I wanted to do that kind of stuff. You know, my biggest thing that I, when I started the channel is I did the, I know what I saw series. And unfortunately, I, because COVID hit, I ran out of people to interview. And then um, I kind of just drained myself trying to keep myself active in the filming. And then, and then I started budgeting and I've honestly just been dedicating all of my time and space on my phone to that. So um, yeah, anyway, so I'm gonna start by, of course, I'll show you guys the pumpkin, make sure you guys know that it's all me doing all the work. I obviously need to clean this pumpkin still. I'm gonna be putting the face on this side. Um, but yeah, so there's the pumpkin. You guys know it's all gonna be me. I'm going to move over to the other side of the table so that I can take all the guts and stuff out of it. And then we will get started. 
So let's do that. Okay, so I have now en entered the much messier side of the room. As you can see, I've got all my budgeting stuff in this thing behind me and all that thing behind me. Um, it's a little messier than you guys are used to seeing. I'm so sorry for that. That's just my bad. Um, <laughs> I'm just, I've got stuff everywhere. Oh, look. Um, so that's another thing is I've recently bought a new tuner and a new capo and I'm going to start trying to play my guitar again. It'll be the first time I've picked up my guitar other than for like a video to show it off. I don't think I've attempted to play it since like 2016. So I'm going to be trying to pick it up and see where I am, see if muscle memory is really a thing. All right. So I need this. I need this. And I need this. Start by giving a quick little tidy up just because it is dirty, dirty, dirty. So if you guys watched my last video that I filmed with my son, you'll know that he had a hockey game. Um, oh no. You'll know that he had a hockey game, a couple hockey games this past week. Um, we played, what did we play? We played Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. He had skating on Tuesday. Today is Wednesday and he's not doing anything. I know I was supposed to film this the other day, but I didn't. But anyway, um, the game that we had on Monday, he scored his first goal. Ah! It's really exciting. I'm so proud of him. And I've got a video that I will insert here. Shoot it in! All right, I'm going to start. So I'm going to be doing it up here. I did recently see a trend where people are starting to carve underneath. But that weirds me out. <laughs> so I'm not going to do that. This is the worst part. Is carving and taking off the top and taking out the guts. This is the worst part. So I'm probably going to fast forward. Like really fast forward through it. Um, so if I do that. Then I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay. There it is. Ick. There we go. So put that aside. I'll bring you guys back and um, be right there. All right. So now that the pumpkin is all, well, it's not fully cleaned off yet, but there we go. Okay, so let's start the planning process. So my plan here is, first I'm gonna cut these guys out. So that I can show you the general idea I have on where everyone's going to go. I think with Chelsea, I might have to do some fudging around with her hair because it didn't, it just looks kind of, it just didn't turn. I don't think she'll be happy with how it turned, without, with how it printed out. <laughs> so, okay. We got Mocus. All right, so the way that I plan to have it is one and two, okay? And then these two are gonna be kind of more on the inside, like so, okay? Stay. And then I've got the word fear that's gonna be up here. That's how I'm planning it. We'll hope, we'll, we'll see if it goes how I plan. I think really the important thing is that I get everyone in a spot where I can make sure I have enough room for the fear part. So maybe if I go down a little more, but anyway, so that's the plan. So the way I do this, so these days a lot, not all, but a lot of um, kits come with uh, these, little po these little pokers. Um, so, oops, good Lord. Okay, so what I'm, ugh, hold on a sec. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use my little poker. I'm going to go around the entire perimeter, for lack of a better word, um, of the photo. And then I'm going to kind of go through his individual features. And then once I've poked it out, then I'm going to use, oh, I have the same issue every year. I literally bought this four 
<laughs> pumpkin carving and I can never open it. I know it slides. I know you do it. I know you work. I know it goes that way too. <gasps> Got it. Okay. So then I am going to use this here little flathead screwdriver, which I can almost never. There we go. And I'm going to just pull out the chunks, which you guys will see. I'll make sure you see. Um, but yeah, I actually started doing these carvings. Get out of there, Mocus. I actually started doing these carvings when I was 16. The first carvings that I ever did. Oh, the first carvings that I ever did were actually of my favorite band. Um, I want to say at the time, but honestly, if they hadn't have broken up in 2011, they would still be my favorite band. Um, anyway, so I've been doing these kind of things for a really long time. This, it, I mean, I'm expecting at some point it's not going to work out. And to be fair, if it doesn't work out, you guys will never see this video. Uh, <laughs> because that's where my confidence is at. My button just opened. Come back. Okay. So I'm going to get started. I think I'm going to start, maybe I should start with the two in the middle and work my way out. I feel like that would be a smarter move. So I'm going to start with Dakota, I think. And I always have to keep it really close to me. Otherwise, it just doesn't work. Okay. So I'm going to go here. And I didn't color them in like I probably should have, but I think, I think I know where everything goes. So the biggest thing is once you start, you cannot let your photo move. Cause if your picture moves, the whole pumpkin is obviously going to be ruined. Um, and I probably should have made these a little bit bigger, but because it was four people and it's, I just didn't have the room. <sighs> Here's hoping for the best. And if they don't turn out good, I still hope you'll check out their channel because they are about to start releasing their Halloween special, which I do believe they're in like England. So that'll be cool because I know that shit is haunted in England. I'm, I'm, what's the word? I'm putting it off. I'm, um, stalling. I'm nervous. All right, here we go. There's no going back starting now. All right, so you guys will not be able to see it very well, but I did get Dakota done. I didn't actually poke where, um, you guys can't see it anyway, but I did, I actually tried something new. I didn't actually poke where his mouth was. I just kind of like traced it um, because that's kind of just what I felt like doing because I thought it would be easier to see. So we'll have to see what happens. Yeah, I think I kind of figured it out. Okay, so let's go for Chelsea <sighs> because why not? Wish me luck. I'm most I'm I'm most nervous about Chelsea because I know like I think the thing is with guys is guys think everything's cool but girls actually like really care. So I'll give it a go. Here we go. Okay, so I've just done Chelsea too, and now I'm kind of getting a little bit nervous. So I'm going to actually do the joining of the lines right away. Normally I wait until I'm done because there's so many faces. I don't want to mess anybody up or get anyone confused. I'm going to start now. So yeah, I'm going to use my flathead screwdriver and I'm going to connect the dots essentially. Um, so I'll do a couple on camera and then I'm going to turn the camera back off and I'm going to finish up on my own. So this is the really, really tedious part. Okay, so I've now done Dakota and Chelsea. Um, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I kind of got lost a little bit on Chelsea. So hopefully we can make it work. Um, but now I'm about to start on Tanner and uh Alex and hopefully it goes a little easier <laughs> all right I actually haven't even been keeping track of how long this has taken me I have realized that I put them a little bit lower than I wanted them to be but that's okay I think I'm gonna start on Tanner because I think he'll be easier to figure out like where I'm at <laughs> I don't know I don't know why um Alex turned out to be so small 
either. I'm kind of almost thinking about redoing, like reprinting his. Otherwise, it's gonna be like it's gonna be like really, really small for Tan or for Alex, and then huge for Tanner. So I don't know. Uh, maybe I'll start with Alex, and then maybe bring Tanner down in size. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. So uh, here we go. All right, guys. So I have been going at this for about. I don't even think it's been two hours. I think it's been about an hour and a half. And I've got them all etched in. And now I'm going to start removing the pieces. So I always say to keep your stencils to use as reference. Um, but then again, you're just going to use a flathead screwdriver, which I've kind of already used a lot of. And I'm going to start on Alex. And I'm going to start taking out some chunks. So um, anything that's like skin I know is coming out. So like his ear, which you guys can't see, but I can. I'm going to move this a little closer too. So his ear will come out. And then this neck, neck part here, there's a part of his neck. And I'm going to take that out. And the way that this is kind of done is it's all based on like where the light would reflect. So if there was a flash on, that's why this part would be showing. Or if he was wearing dark clothing, which I do believe that they all were because it was thumbnails and everything behind them was dark. And I do believe that that would be the case. All right, so neck piece is out. Okay, so next I'm gonna try to focus on the areas like, I know you guys can't even see what I'm talking about. Next, I'm gonna try to focus on some of the areas like around his nose. So the parts that are actually punched in are parts that are supposed to be staying. And that's where I usually get stuck is when I start accidentally pulling out parts that are supposed to stay in. Now, Alex, is a horse of a different color because I'm not sure. I mean, I guess I did Elton Cast Day and he has facial hair, but honestly, I'm really happy these guys were wearing hats <laughs> because it actually made my life a lot easier. And I'm realizing I didn't do anything with this line. So I'll do it now. There we go. But yeah, the hats make it all very easy. Like I actually think Tanner is the easiest um, carving I'll ever do because of the glasses and because of the hat. Like he didn't, know, he didn't know he did, but he made my life so easy. So thank you to Tanner for that. Um, <laughs> all right, I'm going to continue on with this and I'll be back. All right, it is, it's been about probably three hours, two hours now, three hours now. And I've got, so there's Alex, there's uh, Dakota, Chelsea, and I'm just about to start Tanner. And then I think I'm going to do like a line around them. And then I'm going to put the fear on the top here. So hopefully that all works out. And um, sometimes I just like to check in so you guys know that I'm still doing the work. I don't know. I'm always afraid you guys are gonna be like, no, that you guys, you got a professional to do it or something. No, well, that's really tooting my own horn. All right, so I'm gonna finish up Tanner and then I'll be back. See you soon. All right, guys, I'm back. I think I started this around 12:30 and it is now like four. What time is it? Um, it's uh, four forty-five. Four forty-five. Okay, so here is what I think is the finished product. So, we've got. Alex, Dakota, I'm so sorry, Chelsea, I did my very best. Tanner, I think, looks most mostly the most like himself. And then we've got the fear at the top here. And I'm going to 
find a light to put in it. Um, I thought there was a pack right there. Sometimes I have to go back in and scrape out the insides to make it thinner because you only kind of take the skin off the pumpkin, but we'll see what happens. I'll get the light, see if we see anything. It's still pretty bright out, so. Okay, I gotta, I gotta do some more carving, so I'll be right back. All right, guys, so I finished it. So we've got, once again, Alex, Dakota, Chelsea, which I did my best. She actually looks pretty good. Looks kind of cartoony, but still. And then Tanner. And I do have a candle in there, but I might have to wait till it's darker because it's not really lighting up that much right now because it's too light in here. Where'd you get this from, Misha? But as soon as it's dark enough, I will show you guys the actual finished product. Okay, so it's now dark outside and I am going to show you guys the finished product. Um, I don't know if my lights are bright enough, but we're going to do the best we can. Here we go. All right, so there we go. So we've got Alex, Dakota, Chelsea, whose eyes look a little, <laughs> sorry. And then Tanner, who definitely looks the most like himself. Only because I think of the glasses and the hat. It made everything so much easier. But the fear actually looks really cool too. So yeah, there is the finished product. I hope it looks enough like them. I know it looks kind of cartoony, but I think they all kind of end up looking like that after they've been carved out. So yeah, that's that. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoy it. Um, I really do love doing these. It, it It's hard to get started because I always have a lot of doubt. That, like, it's not going to turn out. It's going to be bad. I won't even be able to post it. I'm going to waste the whole day. But no, I actually think this might be my best one yet. So, um, yeah, you guys will have to let me know in the comments below. And, you know, feel free to, like, I don't know, tag them or whatever if you can. I don't really know if that's even a thing you can do. Um, but feel free to let them know that I did this. Maybe, maybe they'll like it too. So, thanks so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Take care. Bye.